Hello, Quiz Helper here. Today, I will be showing you how to use the bulk create feature in Canva for my soon to be released Would You Rather quiz template. Please note, sounds are included in the template, but Canva's bulk create feature cannot duplicate the sounds beyond the first slide, so it'll be up to you to copy the sounds to each of the remaining slides. Let's get this thing started. First, move the slider in the timeline a bit, so all of the elements are shown on the screen. If you don't have the bulk create option yet, go to apps, then search for bulk create. It will be the first option. Click on bulk create, then click on enter data manually at the bottom. I will provide a template with the options shown on the screen. As you can see, we can change the page number, page title, YouTube channel name, answer 1, answer 2, and both images as well. For this example, I'm only creating one page. Page number will be 2, title will be would you rather. Channel name is Quiz Helper. I'm giving a generic answer for both answer fields, then selecting two images from my Canva Uploads folder. Then, I click Done, and then we connect the data. Page number connects to page. Title connects to title. Answer 1 connects to answer 1. Answer 2 connects to answer 2. Image 1 connects to image 1. Image 2 connects to image 2. I forget to show it, but quiz channel connects to the quiz name on the right side of the screen. I move the slider on the timeline again, and click on the answer boxes, and reconnect the data appropriately. Notice how I have two of the same options in the template. This makes it easier to create the animation effects. Then we create generate at the bottom left, and see our results. And there you have it. You are now able to create Would You Rather quizzes in just minutes. Soon you'll be on your way on creating a popular and profitable quiz channel. If you are new to this channel, all videos are free to use for subscribers. You can find many backgrounds, countdown timer bars, tutorials and more. If you have any questions, please leave them in the comment box. Thanks again for your support. See you next time.